here the 16 battery packs are there each battery has 12 volt so 192 volt bus dc bus voltage has been prepared and this dc will be given to directly through this dashboard meter of this vehicle these two meters are showing this one is discharge another is voltage terminal voltage condition of the battery and this is the e vehicle motor that which motor is coupled with the axle of the wheel so now i want to discuss the wireless power transfer system for static suppose the vehicles are under static condition you will see over the road or over the platform this is the vehicle gap there is no electrical connection in between that and here 1000 watt resistive load is there as well as the half horsepower motor is here it will take the power from this unit so you will see this the power is delivered to motor there is no connection in between the, this roadways and in between the vehicle so this is the air gap over the air gap the power will be transferred and this unit is totally e vehicle unit there the receiver that this coil is receiver for the power taking and after that it will be delivered the different kinds of power the dc power voltage level by means of this converter dc converter and here it is showing already the dc bus voltage for this vehicle but here the current is not uh, under discharge condition as because vehicle is under standstill so here i shall show you that this is the static condition under static condition thousand power thousand watt power will deliver in this and as well as the if you switch on the this video that here you will see that under battery charging condition that e vehicles is not moving but battery is under charged condition so these batteries are under charge condition here you see that whenever we increase the length or height over the road they are beyond the control then you will see this will transfer is stop so there is no transfer of power this is beyond control so whenever this under this level that gap is maintained so at that condition it will be done here whenever it is coming over this next vehicle so here again it will move covers this vehicle part so automatically it will trap this it will sense automatically that vehicle is coming over the road so it will automatically it will catch the power okay and after that if i ignite this other coil so automatically it will catch the power from the next coil so next coil if i ignite so again if i move this so this coil is moving over this and then again if we move this coil to this point so automatically it will transfer this and as well as the battery charging here you see that battery charging is possible as well as if the, the vehicle is under running condition so at this condition running condition here you see that motor is running so under this motor running condition the vehicle is taking this power from dedicated length for the motor driving as well as the battery charging whenever it will move again it will for momentum next next point it will come so whenever this movement of the vehicle is there for momentum it will reach the next one and it will take power the total highway will be solar power as well as the grid power that's why it is called hybrid power driven Thank you.